So I, I thought about, you know what teachers are? I mean, what is teaching? I mean, how many of you had to take education courses at some point in your life? Raise your hand. Man, most of you, vast majority of you did. Did you have to write sometime what you, what you think teaching was all about? And, and I, I've read textbooks, and I've read those. I taught undergraduate and graduate college for 10 years. I had those I had did, did a little bit of that just to see what they thought. And I got these wonderful flowery things. Teaching is the act by which somebody who knows something imparts knowledge, and on and on, all that crap. It really boils down to a very, very simple thing. And I'd like to share with you Sousa's definition of what is teaching. And this is it. It's the only profession on this planet whose job it is to change the human brain every single day. That's what we do. Now, I have said this a thousand times all over the world, and every time I say it, I get shivers up my spine. I'm getting shivers. I'm getting goosebumps right now. Just the thought of it. My job here today is to change your brain. It's, it's just to make some new connections. In other words, I'll make it even shorter for you. Teachers are brain changers. Well, damn it, if we're brain changers, doesn't it make sense that the more we understand about how that brain works, the better we can be at that? Hello? It's okay to talk back to me. Does that make sense? Yeah, by the way, talk. This, this, this is, a, um, I think, a revolution in our profession. It's a rejuvenation. So let's be happy about it. It's a wonderful time to be in this profession. Sure, we have our problems. Never before this community has demanded so much of our schools. We don't just teach kids anymore. We raise kids in many places. In local parentis, has never been truer. But the good news is we're learning more about how this brain works. And technology can help us with that. But like any good innovation, it has its positives and it has its negatives. We'll talk more about the positives today. We're brain changers. When you are in that classroom and you are working with your students, this is what's happening in their brain. New connections are being made. They're thinking, making connections from what you're presenting today to what they already know. They're searching their long-term storage areas to find out, what do I know about this so far? Does this make sense to me? What, why do I have to know this? What's it going to do with me? That's what's happening. This is what makes us such an incredible profession. We change people's brains every day. This has become so important that we actually have a new science that has evolved now. It's called educational neuroscience. It's kind of the interface between neuroscience, pedagogy, the, the art of teaching, and psychology. Sometimes it's called mind, brain, and education. But it's a new science. It's now officially a science. And I hope you'll pay attention to it because it's designed to help us and you become more successful at what you do in the classroom. Or if you're an administrator, same thing. Because you're trying to change teachers' brains or you're trying to change parents' brains. No matter what you do, everybody in this room is a brain changer in some way. The more you know about how it works, the better you can be at it.